Hi, Teresa. I wanted to share with you one of my very favorite Teresa memories. It happened on the very first day of work for me here in Searcy Public Schools. It was in July of 1994 and I was at the ripe age of 28 years old and I was coming to my very first day of work. So when I got to the central office, you told me to sit down and wait on Mr. Wood because he had somebody in his office. And so I did, and I was kind of shaking a little bit. It was new and everything was kind of scary. And you noticed that and you said, honey, would you like to go get a cup of coffee or something while you wait? And I said, okay. So I went to the kitchen, got a cup of coffee, um, and then came back and was sitting there drinking my coffee, waiting on Mr. Wood. Well, a few minutes later, um, another man walks in and he is highly upset and he says, Teresa, this was Mr. Walton, who was the assistant superintendent at that time. He says, Teresa, how many times have I told y'all that if you get the last cup of coffee in the pot to make another pot of coffee? And I was like going, oh my gosh, in my mind, because I didn't realize I'd gotten the last cup of coffee. I knew it was low, but, um, and you said, now Mr. Walton, just settle down. This is our new child nutrition director and I sent her after coffee. We can't expect her to make coffee yet. She said, so you just settle down. And he just kind of deflated and said, oh, I'm sorry. And then he walked off. And I was just thinking, man, I really need to get to know this secretary because she has lots of power. And so I was really, that made me feel so at home. But also it was just funny after I got to thinking about it. Then another favorite story of mine was when I moved up to this office building. I had been down in the maintenance building for several years and they added on to the administration building early 2000s, I think. And I came in my office, I'd been getting it ready and it just seemed kind of scary to me to be in the big glass house, you know, for the change. So I was sitting in there just kind of contemplating the day, uh, the first day I was in there and you walked up to the door and you said, I have got something for you. And she said, I, you said, I'm so happy. And I said, what? And you, and you said, here's your first fax for when you are in the building. She said, this is so precious. And I was like, oh, okay. <laughs> and I just laughed and we laughed together and it just kind of broke the ice for my day. And I can't tell you how many times that you just made it feel like home. And uh, it's like another mom. And my kids felt the same way, like another grandma. And I really appreciate that. We love you.